red pandas. Red pandas. Here's our table of contents. Guess who? It's the size of a cat, but it's not that. It has ears like a bear, but it's much more rare. It's out on the it's out with the moon, but it's not a raccoon. Do you need another clue? Or can you guess who? It's a red panda. Many people know about giant pandas. They are big and have black and white fur. Red pandas share the name panda, but red pandas are giant and giant pandas are different animals. Here's a giant panda and here's a red panda. A red panda is sometimes called a fire fox, yet a fox and a red panda are not in the same family either. A forest home. Red pandas live in the mountain forests of Asia. It gets cold in the mountains, so red pandas have thick fur all over. Even on the bottoms of their feet have fur. All this fur keeps them warm. Life in the trees. Red pandas are super climbers. They run quickly over branches. The red panda's body helps it live in trees. They have a long tail. A, a long tail helps them balance on tree branches. Feet. Fur on the bottoms of their feet keeps them from slipping off the wet tree branches. Claws. Sharp claws grip the trees while it climbs. Their wrist bones. This long bone acts like a thumb and helps the red panda hang on to the branches. Lots of leaves. Red pandas find food in trees and on the ground. They eat lots and lots of bamboo leaves. They also munch on fruit, grass, and mushrooms. Bamboo leaves are a favorite food. Day sleeper. Red pandas are active early in the morning and at sunset. They are often active at night too, but they rest in the middle of the day. Red, pan red pandas dangle with their legs when it's hot. They curl up when it's cold. Five fun facts about red pandas. One, red pandas have very long tails. Their tails are almost as long as their bodies. Two, they lift themselves clean like a house cat does. This is called grooming. Three, Newborns have fur. New, 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 newborns have hardly any fur on the bottoms of their feet. The fur grows in as they get older. Four. In winter, they may spend up to 13 hours a day looking for bamboo and eating it. Five. Red pandas eat about 200,000 bamboo leaves every day. Little ones. A mother makes a nest out of sticks, leaves, and grass. She will have her babies in the nest. Between one and four babies will be born. They are called cups. A red panda's nest is usually in a tree. Cubs don't look, cubs don't look red when they are born. They are grayish brown. They drink milk and grow bigger. Then their fur turns red. Their mother's their mo the mother moves her cub by picking it up in her mouth. Something to say. When cubs make a high whistle, their mom comes running. It means the cubs need something right now. Adult red pandas also make noises. They may twitter, squeak, or snort. Home area. Red pandas mostly live alone. Each red panda lives in its own area called it calls home. Sometimes another red panda stops by, but it won't stay for long. Hide and seek. Red pandas are shy. They hide when a, a predator is near. They blend in the forest. Their black fur matches the shadows. Their red fur matches the moss on trees. Can you see this red panda? Let's see, I think it's right here. Red moss on the trees looks like this. We are still learning about red pandas. They are hard to find and study in the wild. People are trying to save the forest where the red pandas live. If we save the forest, we can save their home. What in the world? These pictures are close-up views of the things red panda in a red panda's world. 
Use hints to help us figure out what's going on in the pictures. Here's one hint. This is, this is it. This part is striped like a raccoon. Red pandas spend a lot of time here. They eat a lot of these. Red pandas have this all over. These are used for climbing. Cubs live here after they are born. The end.